the Sunday evening, everybody. We are about to make a tropical fruit trifle. It's gonna be great. We're loving all the fruit desserts. It's a dessert with like cake and fruit, pudding, or we're gonna make a whipped cream, like a, well, not really a whipped cream, but a heavy cream mixture. Yeah, this weather that's uh, feeling and looking like spring is making us want all the fruity desserts. And I wish we would've thought of this earlier today and we would've made it then because these get better as they sit. So the first thing we need to do is cut all of our fruit or should we make the mixture first? Let's cut the fruit first. Yeah, we have pineapple and this lemon, it's just, we've been putting it in water and tea and stuff. It's just hanging out there. Dragon fruit, Ingles has these two packs right now for a good deal. I think they're trying to get rid of them. We're gonna use coconut, but we're using these coconut chips. Titus and the kids like these better than coconut flakes. They are easier to chew. We're also gonna use some strawberries. So let's see, strawberries, pineapple, dragon fruit, coconut chips, and bananas. We're gonna go ahead and use these two bananas because they're trying to peel themselves. So, because I know this is the one everybody is most excited about, we're gonna cut into it first. Let's see, so here's the end of it. It's a little off center, so we're gonna cut at a little bit of a slant. See how pretty it is? Now we'll cut this end. All right, so we've got both ends cut, just like that. Now you just take your knife and cut into the peeling just a little so you can get up under there and it'll peel right off. These are pretty ripe. That's why I'm saying I'm pretty sure Ingles is trying to get rid of these so they're doubling them up and selling them at a good price. There we go. We might need to go ahead and do both of them so the other one doesn't go, well, we'll save the other one to go with breakfast in the morning. So now we're just gonna cut it in half. Then we cut it in half again so that we can get some little triangle shapes. That's what we wanna have here. So now we're just gonna cut those. Mind if I sample Yeah, go ahead, John. Let's go sample it. Kiwi. Yeah, that's what it reminds me of is kiwi. The strawberries, I'm going to cut into fours. Just like that. Little strawberry wedges. John is getting the stems off of some more of them for me. And we'll put these over here on the plate with the dragon fruit. I really wish we would have thought of this earlier today. We could already be having some right now. But it's really quick and easy to make. Chopping up the fruit is what takes the longest. Maybe just uh, two more, Jonah. And then you don't even have to do the homemade mixture. I mean, like, you can make it easier. You can make a pudding or use, you know, Cool Whip and stuff like that instead. I think that's got all of those. Now, the bananas. You want to peel those for me, John? Yeah. And I'll get the pineapple cutter out real quick. We're just going to slice the bananas pretty thin. We'll save the strawberry stems for the chickens tomorrow. I tell you what, that's a very unusual fruit right there, isn't it? Yeah. You want to try a piece? Yeah. What's it taste like? Mmm. Well, really good. Does it taste like a kiwi? It really tastes like nothing. It's kind of... Nothing? Like a little mush in your mouth? Feels like summer. It's cold. It's kind of cold. It's kind of hard to say what it tastes like. It's good. For the pineapple, we just cut the top off. And then we just take our little pineapple cutter here. I've showed y'all this before. We got it from Aldi. I don't even know. Probably two years ago. I probably had this one for about two years, but they get them back in from time to time. You can find them on... Amazon and probably Walmart and stuff too though. So they have a little number line here. One, two, and three. So you just put it up beside the pineapple and measure where it goes to and that's how far you can spin down without busting out the bottom. So this one's a little bit under the one. A lot of times I mess up and miss it even, but I'm trying to do it even this time. I think I got it. Mommy, you always kind of go sideways on yeah, that girl. Yeah, can you hold this in? And we'll pull it. All right, everybody. She always kind of gets sideways on this deal right here. Ready? Yep. Okay, woo! The cake is the only thing left that we have to cut, and we just have a regular angel food cake. So how are we gonna do that? Are we gonna pluck well, it apart, or are we just gonna... We'll just cut this as we get ready to put it into the bowl. Are we gonna cut it like in layers? In what? little squares. No, we're gonna do little squares. Yeah, little cubes. Little cubes of angel That's food just cake. That's about the same as what I'm talking about. Pluck it. Oh, well, I mean, you can pluck it, but it's just not gonna... It. I'm not talking about like pluck up. Oh. Chicken for the grill. Good. <laughs> what? Ooh, All right. Now, good. I'm gonna go ahead. And yeah, start you can go ahead and be doing that. Squares. I'll start mixing the whipped cream mixture that we're gonna make. We're gonna use heavy cream, and instead of putting any sugar or anything like that, like we normally would if we were making whipped cream, we're gonna put cream of coconut. <laughs> this is probably the most moist, moist angel food cake that I've ever 
Yeah. Man, that thing would probably be really tasty. Taste it. We're not going to be able to use it all. We'll probably just use about half of it for this because it, it goes a long way. That's really good. We're just using this big clear bowl to put it in. Uh, I don't have a big, you know, trifle bowl, one of those that, that would be really, really pretty. That's really good, y'all. I mean, it needs to be a little bit smaller. More smaller than that, yeah. everybody? Okay. Yeah, maybe like, uh, I'm thinking like this. About this big of, you know, cubes. Like these feet. Here. Yeah. You got any problem with that? That's Steak good. Now for every That's fine. Piece. That's fine. In the mixer, we're putting two cups of heavy cream. I may need three. You know, how big is this going to be? It's going to be a pretty good size. Yeah. Bill. You know what? We're going to go with three cups. Three cups of heavy cream, and we don't want this to become extremely thick whipped cream. We want it to be kind of pudding texture, I guess. I'm going to take my pineapple juice and not pour the pineapples in here, but just the juice from that pineapple is going in here with the heavy cream and also a pineapple. Dove in. We'll get that out. Nobody worry. Okay. Let me have it. I'll eat that joke. I'm gonna go ahead and let this start whipping up a little bit, and then we'll pour in some of the cream of coconut. I have some right here left over from yesterday, but it's been in the refrigerator, so it's pretty solid. Yeah. We'll see if we can get some of the just the liquid out of this can. Yeah. Probably about a fourth of a cup, maybe a little more than a fourth of a cup of the cream of coconut liquid. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he gonna get a haircut, y'all. Here in a minute. He gonna get one. Oh, I don't know. In a minute? In a yes, minute? I need a haircut. What? I'm starting to look like the darling or something. What? I can already tell this is fixing to be really something good. Okay, I'm gonna something go ahead really and put good. some of that solid in there, too. We got about a fourth of a cup of the liquid. See if I can get a little bit more. Yeah, there we go. Pour some of that in there, too, Mom. Yeah, I did. I, I put mean, a little bit. Right it ain't Friday. Was you about to say it's Friday? It ain't Friday. I'm just living up. It's Friday. That's <laughs> good. We probably are. I think we're gonna get about three layers. So we'll pour about a third of it over here. Okay, I think that's good for the first one. We spread that around and then we just repeat. Oh, what happened to you over here? I stopped chopping. <laughs> all right, I gotta get back on what I was doing over here, buddy. <laughs> I'm coming for the cake and this is all that was over there. Now I gotta get back to work. Now she's doing what I said at first, just plucking it apart. <laughs> Forget the cake. Now she's plucking. <laughs> I see what you it's got. It's faster. It is faster. It is faster. We're just going to plug everybody. Forget that knife. Just plug. Now the fruit layers again. Let's see. You, you know. Got a, you got a little barbecue coming up. You know what I'm saying? You got a little oh, get yeah, together. This is really pretty for spring. You go, you go make something like this the night before. Take mm -hmm. it the next day. I promise you, they'll flock to this right here, buddy. Come on, we forgot to put this. Oh, we forgot that. Well, it's okay. We'll put them on this one. Go ahead and shake them off. Yeah, let me go ahead and shake them off. Everybody, it's we forgot the coconut chips. <laughs> coconut chips. I almost got choked on one while ago. <laughs> you know what, did, baby? I was sitting back here. I thought you was about to call nine one one. Fallon grabbed me and did the hymn. <laughs> She was like, you ain't leaving me. I'll go to heaven right now. Let's see, what comes after the banana? I keep forgetting my pattern every time. Okay, let me wash my hands. We were gonna put a little bit of this, but that's okay. It's fine. Yeah. It'll still be, because this cream mixture is so, you know, it's it'll moisten it all up. It'll be fine. Yeah. We're making this up. It's not like we're following a recipe. So let's just pretend we changed our mind. We didn't want to put the strawberry. You know, glaze I didn't want to do that strawberry glaze, baby. No, nope. I'm glad you didn't. Me do too. That. I was hoping myself I'd forget. <laughs> I think some pecans. Oh, I forgot. The top of that right there, probably nice with just a mint leaf. We're gonna crush some pecans. Yeah. We've decided we're just gonna leave it with the cream and the mint leaf on top and a little crushed pecans. Hey, pecan and a few little chopper. coconut chips on top will look good too. A few little the, coconut with chips. With the pecans, yeah. That with wouldn't be pecan. too much. Yeah. All right, everybody. <laughs> you press. <laughs> you press this thing. Yeah. Okay. Right there it is. Everybody hang on. Jonah made me this little strawberry right here. There we go. There you go, everybody. <laughs> This is another one of them kind. I could eat this whole thing right here before you. That's really good. <laughs> 